Hello, friends and family from around the world. This is Mike with Morning Dew, daily events worldwide, and we're on January 24th, 2021. Welcome to another surviving day on the planet, and welcome to an update video here, earthquake update video, worldwide seismic event. That's right, this is a 24-hour map of earthquakes, and as you can see, it has gotten worse over the past even six hours, 12 hours, but especially since the large 7.3 downgraded to a 6.9 earthquake, Shetland Islands, Antarctic plate. Now, right after that large earthquake, there were many earth uh, aftershocks, and the area is called the Wordy Seamount. Uh, the Wordy Caldera, otherwise known as so most likely, this could be an underwater volcano in Antarctica sending seismic waves across the planet. And then there was a large 5.8 earthquake in Chile just moments after the 7.8 or 7.3 downgraded to 6.9. But look at the last 24 hours for earthquakes. Very busy. Now let's have a look at USGS, show you the topography of the area and exactly where these earthquakes were located. South Shetland Islands, right off the fault line, a little area here that is called the Wordy Caldera or the Wordy Seamount, which is most likely an underwater volcano when it's called a caldera. So 6.9 rang out. And then many large aftershocks have been rippling across the planet. I'm going to show you exactly what I mean by that in a moment when I show you the heli plots, which are just crazy. But just recently, we had earthquake here east of South Sandwich Islands and as well southwest of Africa, 5.1 recorded here all along the fault lines, Antarctic Fault. So the Pacific Disaster Center did put out tsunami warning, but there was no tsunami in effect. But yet people were putting out videos about a tsunami. It's not right. It's not true. And you can see here, Pacific Disaster Center, no tsunami is expected. So they have to put out these tsunami watches. So a tsunami watch was put out for the area of Shetland Islands and as well parts of the Atlantic but no tsunami was detected but there were definitely seismic waves detected across the planet so now USGS also has heliplots which record the very low, low frequency data and you can see the seismographs every single one looks like this. Not one country that has a seismograph to record the waves was spared. All over China, New Mexico, Samoa, Philippines, Alaska, Thailand. Look at Casey, Antarctica. So that's after that large 7.3 last night. So what is happening in Antarctica? What is happening with our plates right now? We are shifting big time. And I think it has a lot to do with the magnetic reversal and what our magnetic what and what our magnetosphere is going through due to due to the solar cycles that we are currently going through. So heads up everybody, this is a big heads up. Something is happening across the planet. And it's being recorded on every seismograph. Large 7.3 last night in an Antarctic seamount, a caldera. I'm going to leave you here just looking at all of these seismographs. I could probably scroll through here all day and show you some really strange anomalies and large signatures. But I need you all to stay aware and prepared. And please share this video with your friends and family. Because something's coming. Something's coming big time. 
prayers for humanity. Thanks for watching. Stay aware and prepared. Stay young and have fun. And get your morning due. Bye-bye now. If you enjoyed today's video, please hit that like button, subscribe, share with your friends and family from across the world.